good morning everyone this is rohit gupta i am working as assistant professor in st andrews institute of technology and management in electrical engineering semester 4 my subject uh, subject i am teaching you subject numerical methods and probability statistics in today's topic finite difference operator that is uh, finite difference operator shift operator and uh, forward operator backward operator and relation between them okay so let's start finite difference operator if i have taken a point x not x not x1 x2 xn be equispaced with step size h as you have taken um, as you have seen your stairs stairs are equispaced means एक स्टेयर से दूसरे स्टेयर की जो का जो हाइट होता है दैट इज सेम मींस फर्स्ट स्टेयर एंड सेकंड स्टेयर के अगर मैंने मान लिया कि सेकंड फर्स्ट और सेकंड स्टेयर के बीच का हाइट आई थिंक सिक्स सेंटीमीटर और सिक्स इंच सॉरी सिक्स इंचेस देन सेकंड और थर्ड के बीच का भी सिक्स इंच हाइट होगा थर्ड और फोर्थ के बीच का भी सिक्स इंच हाइट होगा इफ आई एम टेकिंग अगर इफ आई एम टेकिंग टॉकिंग अबाउट सिक्स सिक्स स्टेयर सिक्स एयर की हाइट कितनी होगी फर्स्ट स्टेयर प्लस फाइव इंटू हाइट या तो ग्राउंड से लेंगे तो सिक्स इंटू हाइट ऑफ वन स्टेयर तो अगर मैंने कहा एक्स आई तो एक्स आई की वैल्यू क्या होगी आयत स्टेयर इज इक्व टू एक्स नॉट दैट इज ग्राउंड पॉइंट प्लस आई इंटू मीन आई नंबर ऑफ स्टेयर आई एंड एच इज अटेप साइज दैट इज कॉल्ड हाइट ऑफ स्टेयर I की वैल्यू क्या हो सकती है वन टू थ्री एम तक एक्स आई प्लस वन माइनस एक्स आई इक्वल टू एच फॉर ऑल आई फिर एच इज कॉल्ड स्टेप साइज बट इज स्टेप साइज क्या होता है फर्स्ट पॉइंट मीन एनी पॉइंट आई एंड इट्स प्रीवियस टर्म मीन इफ आई टेक एन एनी पॉइंट आई प्लस वन और इसका प्रीवियस टर्म क्या होगा आई then xi plus 1 minus xi is equals to h this is called step size for equal spaced shift operator for shift operator shift operator is denoted by e if i am taking talking about uh, e of f of xi is equal to kya hoga f of xi plus h or equal to f of xi plus 1 understood hai agar maine kaha ki x what is e called e means shift operator if you are having uh, if you are in first Stair. If I want to shift you, then me, that means you are shifted on second stair. That means f of x i any function f of x i shifted on f of x i plus h, where h is called step side. Or you can say that f of x i plus one because x i plus h is equals to x i plus one. Understood? Okay. Then e to the power r. If I take e to the power r, so where r step r step shift will be done. Then f of x i plus r h r belongs to any number. Understood? Then forward difference operator. What is forward difference operator? Then delta. This delta is f of delta f of x i is equals to f of x i plus h minus f of x i means uh, f of x i plus h means next step minus initial step. जहाँ से हम जिस पॉइंट से लेते हैं, that is called forward difference operator. Now you can write that. F of f, f i plus one minus f i. Understood? Okay. We define for any positive real number. We this will define for any positive real number. Del n of f of x i means i at n at difference operator. So, what will happen? Del n minus one into del f of x i. So, del n minus one f of x, del f of x i. The value will be that f of i plus one minus f of i. So, if I have inside operate, what will happen? Del f i del to the power n minus one f i plus one minus f i. So I have taken the n del common. So you can write that del my n del to the power n minus one f i del n f of x i to power f of x i. In particular, if I have taken n equals to two, so del two of f of x i is equals to del del of f of x i. As we know, because we are knowing that is del f of x i forward difference operator. तो आप फॉरवर्ड डिफरेंस ऑपरेटर की वैल्यू क्या होती है दैट इज एफ ऑफ आई प्लस वन माइनस एफ ऑफ आई 
okay now again apply the forward difference operator so del f i f of i plus 1 minus del f of i so f i plus 1 mein f i plus 2 1 add hoga minus f i plus 1 minus del f i ki value kya hoti hai f i plus 1 minus f i to jab minus lenge to f i plus 1 to minus ya plus sign hai ya minus sign hai to minus aa jayega minus f i plus 1 plus f i minus minus plus ho jayega then we have then we solve this then f i plus 2 Minus two f i plus one plus f i. This is called second order diff second order forward difference operator. Del two f of x i f i plus two minus two f i plus one plus f i. Relation between shift operator and forward difference operator. We know that shift shift operator e is equal to e f of x i equals to f of x i plus h plus But forward difference operator f of x i equals to f of x i plus h minus f of x i. Understood? It? Okay. Now f of x i put put uh, put the value of e of f of x i means f of x i plus h ki value put the value from x uh, equation put the value of f of x i plus h from equation number one. To equation number two, if I put here, then delta f of x i is equals to x a e of shift operator e of f of x i means are f of x i plus h ki value kya hai? E of f of x i minus f of x i understood hai? Then e minus the f of x i taken common, f of x i common bracket me e minus one. This is operator. Then f of x i then del if del f of x i is equals to e minus one. f of x i then then del equals to e minus 1 this is your relation in i think previous year or previous to previous year they ask what is the relation between forward operator forward difference operator and shift op shift operator means they ask relation between forward difference operator delta and shift operator e so this is your relation delta equals to e minus One or they can ask prove that delta equals to e minus one and e equals to similarly e co. When one we have taken another side, then e equals to one plus delta. So delta to the power n f of x i is equals to e minus one k power n f of x i. So apply the binomial theorem. Then this is your k summation k equal to zero to n minus one to the power k n factorial upon k factorial n minus k factorial into f of i plus n minus k. Understood? This is your relation. Another difference operator, backward operator, backward operator delta. Okay? Backward operator me delta kya hota hai? Opposite hota hai. Forward operator me sida, backward operator me opposite. Delta f of x i is equal to f of x i minus f of x i minus h. This can be written as f of x i. को हम क्या लिख सकते हैं? F i minus f i minus one. We define for positive integer n. So delta f of x i is equal to f i minus f i minus one. Understood? Now relation between backward operator and shift operator. So backward operator delta is equal to delta f of x i. As we know that backward operator delta is equal to f of x i. Minus f of x i minus what h? Okay, we know that shift operator e is equal to e of e of shift operator e of f of x i. The value what is f of x i plus h means one if one step shift. If one step shift, so we know that e to power n ka formula what is e to power n is equal to we uh, write there e to power r r e to power n. तो e के पावर n का क्या होगा e पावर n f of x i की वैल्यू क्या हो जाएगी f of x i plus r h सॉरी e के पावर r f of x i की वैल्यू क्या हो जाएगी e के पावर f of x i f of x i plus n r h if i put r equal to minus 1 अगर मैंने r की वैल्यू minus 1 पुट कर दी तो e के पावर minus 1 f of x i is equals to f of x i minus h अंडरस्टूड है ओके सिमिलरली आई पुट द वैल्यू हियर
e ke power minus 1 f of x i is equals to f of x i minus h so delta f of x i is equal to f of x i minus e ke power minus 1 f of x i so we have taken 1 minus e inverse into f of x i understood this is your operator so delta is equals to backward operator delta is equals to 1 minus e inverse understood okay now delta to the power n is equals to f of x i is equals to 1 minus e inverse ke power n now apply binomial theorem f of x i a plus b ke power n to n c 0 a ke power 0 b ke power n plus n c 1 a ke power 1 b ke power n minus 1 something like that so we apply kya? that means sigma k equal to 0 to n minus 1 to the power k n factorial upon k factorial into n minus k factorial f i minus k. f i minus k. Relation between backward operator and forward operator. Okay, if we know that because forward operator delta is equals to e minus 1 and backward operator delta is equals to 1 minus e inverse because I have found this one backward operator delta is equals to 1 minus e inverse and forward operator delta is equals to e minus 1. Now multiply both both one. So backward operator delta into forward operator delta is equals to 1 minus e inverse into e minus 1. So e minus 1 ko 1 se multiple karenge. We can, then simplify this one. So e ko 1 se karenge to e. Minus 1 ko 1 se then minus 1. Minus, then e ko minus e inverse se. So e into e inverse that is 1. So minus 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 plus minus the minus 1. Plus. So minus 1 ko minus e inverse se karenge. Plus e inverse. e plus e inverse minus 2. Now write down central difference operator. Central difference operator is denoted by delta. Okay, delta f of x i is equals to f of x i plus h by 2 minus f of x i minus h by 2. Because we know that shift operator e k power n e k power n f of x i equals to f of x i plus n h. So e k power half f of f of x i is equals to f of x i plus h by 2 e k power minus half f of x i is equals to f of x i minus h by 2. Then we put the value f of x i plus h by 2 ki value kya hai? e k power half f of x i and e k power f of x i minus h by 2 ki value kya hai? e k power minus half f of x i then put the value delta f of x i is equals to e k power half minus e k power minus half f of x i then backward operator sorry uh, central difference operator delta is equals to e k power half minus e k power minus half then the, in, in your examination they ask the relation between central difference operator and shift operator. Sometimes in examination, they uh, they ask you um, they ask you prove that central difference operator delta is equals to e k power half minus e k power minus half. Now another one example is average operator. Average operator is denoted by mu mu of f of x i is equals to f of x i plus h by two plus f of x i minus h by 2 by 2 okay understood because we know that e k power f e as in previous case i have discussed that one e k power half f of x i equals to f of x i plus h by 2 e k power minus half of f of x i equals to f of x i minus h by 2 if anybody asks what is uh, difference sorry relation between mu and e then then you put here e k power half plus e k power minus half by 2 then mu equals to e k power half plus e k power minus half by 2 in your examination they ask what is the different our, our relation between mu and forward operator delta mu and backward operator delta mu and uh, central difference operator relation between mu and central difference any one of them okay then you have to solve these then uh, we have discussed today first First, that is finite difference operator, equispace degree, then shift operator, forward difference operator, backward difference operator, 
and uh, uh, central difference operator and average operator and relation between all these understood okay now a relation between uh, we have discussed the relation between forward operator and backward difference operator okay then okay thank you so much